In a city known for its fearsome super gangs, criminal enterprise like the mob, gangs, Chicago has its own culture from graffiti on the walls to how the south side and the north side are separated. In Chicago, it's where you're born that defines who you are, not your race. This is Gang Life. <laughs> Cartel got me working for the big faces Federally got my car full of brick cases Hit the pen with a grin, there ain't no faking Eyes picked to my back for my shoelaces God out, should've seen the look on they faces All jealous cause your boy stacking hella paper Set up by the crew, they done put a banger In the trunk of my car and left me to hang there No thing, then attorney went and beat the case Got a job digging holes for minimum wage Had a dream that Cato said he proud of me Stay here, don't leave, keep doing your thing Quit the drugs, but you know I went back to selling, six times failing I went back to prison, got my head right, got my bread right Push these weights like a kilo in a tailpipe Trying to do right, I got a mission Trying to give back to my boys in the prison The old me's gone, I ain't never gonna miss them From wrong to strong, stay true to the vision From wrong to, to strong From wrong to strong From wrong to, to strong From wrong to strong Hey, what's up? JC, Wrong Strong, you already know. If you are new to my channel, make sure you subscribe, hit the bell, hit that like button, leave me a good comment, bad comment. I don't give a fuck. <laughs> if you are part of my Wrong and Strong family, because I know you guys are out there warming up the bourbon, getting ready to go for a stroll, super tell us a bourbon. Let's get it, put some gas, and cruise down the north side, south side, down Lakeshore Drive. You already know, Chicago is a beautiful, beautiful city. I miss home, I miss you guys. Thank you, Ron Strong family, for the support, the love, and you already know. I got one that I've been, you know, they've been asking me for this video for a minute. Uh, I've been slacking a little bit on it, but here you got it today. What's the difference between folks and people? That's the way the two gangs are split in Chicago. That's the way it rolls over there. It's the six point star and the five point star. And then it breaks down into even more. But today we're just going to focus on folks and people. The folk nation, commonly referred to as folk or folks, is an alliance of street gangs in Chicago. So pretty much, they can be having beef on the street, but once they hit the prison, they come together as one. It was established in 1978, and the creator, Larry Hoover, you guys already know, heard of him, he is the founder of the Gangster Disciples who pursued many of the leaders of the uh, black gangs, white gangs, and Latino gangs to join in order to create some kind of structure that is lacking out there right now because when there was structure like this, the streets were not as crazy as it is right now. It's always been crazy. Don't get me wrong, but there was a lot of structure within every unit. And when they was this structure, it got fixed really quick. So, if you are part of the folk nation, if you ride with the six, it's the six point star and you wear everything to the right. You cock your hat to the right, you roll your jogging pants, to, on the right side up, everything that has to do with the right side. Like I said it at the beginning of the video, man, Chicago has its very own gang culture that you really don't see in other cities. Has it spread around to other cities? Yes, it has. It's spread to Florida, Texas. It's pretty much spread to a lot of places except California. California has its own 
gang culture also. They have north, south, just like folks and people. Soon after the folk nation was put together, the people nation also formed an alliance with the street gangs that were left in the Chicago area. The rivals of the folks, pretty much that was, that's what it became. The people nation was formed pretty much in reaction to folks nation coming together. Mo the, the main gangs that had a lot to do with it in 1978 were the Black Peace Stones, the Vice Lords, the Land Kings, and later on they invited other gangs that were instrumental to forming that alliance, like the Mickey Cobras, the Land Counts, the Bishops, Spanish Lords. There's, there's a lot of gangs in Chicago. This is why I'm doing this series. I mean, even me being born there, grew up, raised, everything, I still had a hard time, you know, uh, defining the gangs and, and everything back then, you know. Um, sometimes I would end up in, in neighborhoods on the north side and I didn't know whether they were folks or people, you know. Um, Humble Park and the south side are very, very two different cultures, two different worlds. It's the same city. This is what's so crazy. It's the same city, but there are two different worlds and people that are from Chicago, you know, they know this. You know, uh, Humble Park, the north side, I mean, first thing you, when you, you're, you're driving to the north side, you see a Puerto Rican flag the size of a 10 floor building, you know, right on the street. Humble Park is mainly Puerto Ricans, Dominicans, uh, I mean, it's like I said, yes, there's Mexicans over there, but there is a lot of Cubans, a lot of Puerto Ricans, a lot of Dominicans. It is a whole different world from the South Side. And over there, they have some of their own gangs that have been there and, and you know, stood the, the test of time. The OAs are out there, the, the MODs. There's so many branches of different organizations over there that it is, it is, it is crazy. And this is why I'm doing this series to pretty much, you know, um, it, it's like I say, my channel is a learning channel, entertainment, maybe get a couple laughs about my story. You know, there, there's a lot of things about this channel that people don't realize. It's just not prison stories. It's just not, you know, sort of everything. And and the thing is, is that this culture has been untold. When they did um, uh, that gang show, I forgot what it was called, Gangland. They didn't they didn't really break down all the gangs in Chicago. They did the SDs. They did the Land Kings. They did they did. You know, small a small portion of a lot of gangs have withstood the time in Chicago. They've been around since the 50s. I mean, like you guys seen, I did the one on the Gaylords, um, Noble Knights, City Knights, uh, Cobras, Spanish uh, Gangsters, um, Spanish Dragons. I, I mean, I could go on and on and on. And like I said, it's it's its own culture because even from the graffiti. Every gang in Chicago has a mascot. The Imperial Gangsters have the Pink Panther. The Spanish Cobras have a Cobra. The Land Kings have a Master, a King. The SDs have a Baby Devil with the Pitchfork. The, every gang out there has a symbol, a mascot, laws, prayers, you name it. Welcome to Gang Life. Chicago has its own culture, his own traditions, and even in gangs, this is how they roll. My name's JC. I am Wrong and Strong. Enjoy my shenanigans. Enjoy my stories. This is what I do. Hey, don't judge nobody. Give somebody a hug. Stay in your lane. Live savage. And remember, you only have one life to live, but if you live it right, one life is all you need.